All right, so continuation. Um, we uh, painted, uh, put the mix the part A and part B, and started the painting. I started using the uh, given uh, brush, but it just falls apart after some time. Totally fall, uh, but you can still nicely. It's better to use what they give. Um, you can nicely use the uh, nicely apply the paint with that sponge. It's a good, a very absorbent sponge. So I used that and applied it as best as I could, even though the brush started to break up. Uh, then I used my own. I have another one, foam one, much better, less absorbent though, for the finishing touch. Uh, so just a little bit uh, for the finishing touch and there was a little extra paint maybe because my um, top is a little smaller size maybe I don't know but uh, it looks normal size uh, so I guess they give you a little extra paint um, so yeah you know just uh, go up down into the middle make sure everything is covered and uh, try to get it as uh, as uh, smooth as possible without any ups and downs it looks a little rough a little bit over here but I think once it dries it will be fine and yeah you gotta cover everything because this is actually uh, chemical bonding to the porcelain which is strong bonding And the bath works product is supposed to bond to the porcelain chemically so that's a stronger bonding than just a normal paint epoxy paint uh, it's of course important to get down to the porcelain that means preparing the tub is very important with sanding and increasing the bonding by sanding is, is definitely recommended all right